when I kept getting sick, I didn't like it. I kept missing school and sports and playing with my friends. My doctor told me that I should go to the hospital for surgery. He said they would make me feel all better. When the day of surgery came, we woke up very early and drove to the hospital. When we got there, Mom filled out some forms and I got a bracelet with my name and birth date on it. A volunteer met us and showed us where to go. She walked with us through the hospital until we got to the surgery center. She was really nice. When I got to my own special room, the nurse gave me a fun coloring book, a soft teddy bear, and a comfy blanket. I also got to wear special pajamas. I got into bed and the nurse put a clip on my finger to see how much air I was breathing. Then she checked my blood pressure with a cuff that squeezed my arm. It didn't hurt. She used her stethoscope to count my heartbeats and listen to my breathing. Next I got to meet the doctor who was going to be doing my surgery. She let me ask as many questions as I wanted. It was nice to know she cared so much. Then I met the person in charge of my medicine during surgery. He said he would stay by my side the whole time. After I put on a special hat and mom put on a bunny suit, the nurse came to check on us and rolled my bed down the hall. My mom was right there with me. As I entered the operating room, people were preparing the room just for me. Everyone was wearing masks and gowns to keep the germs away. The nurse and my mom helped me hop onto the tall bed. Then the sticky things were put on me to keep track of my heart rate during the surgery. They felt kind of chilly, but they didn't hurt. Warm blankets were added to keep me cozy, and once again they put a blood pressure cuff on my arm and an oxygen sensor on my finger. They put a soft rubber mask over my mouth that smelled fruity. They asked me to breathe in some medicine to make me fall asleep until the surgery was over. I wasn't scared, cause I knew everything was gonna be okay. I woke up after what felt like just a few minutes. The nurses came to my side and were so nice. I just had to wake up a little more before getting to see my mom. I still felt sleepy, but I got to watch TV, eat snacks and color. Then it was time to go home. I feel so much better now. I guess the doctors really do know how to fix my body. Thank you to Grant Nitesca Foundation and Burgraff's Ace Hardware Caring for Kids Charity Classic for making this video possible.